This great moment is brought to you by the Virginia Lottery. In 1992, the VCU baseball team had a memorable run in the NCAA Regional at Texas and came within one win from advancing to the College World Series. Former head coach Tony Guzzo recalls the Rams' run at the College World Series. We were like 31 and 20. That had already set the team home. We lost two straight in the tournament, conference tournament. I got back, I congratulated the guys, I held up the big trophy. Told them how proud I was of them that they had won the championship our first year in the Metro. Uh, no one could ever take that away from us and sent them on their way. And then on, then, then on Monday, two days later, uh, we found out about an hour before the show came on that we were going to Texas uh, for the NCAA regionals. And we had players everywhere. We flew guys in from New York at home. Robbie Grimes heard he was on the beach and he was in Myrtle Beach. Uh, we didn't even find one of the players. Uh, he was in West Virginia fishing. So it was a, a miracle of sorts. I think the key was with our second trip to the NCAA, I was telling the guys, we lost to Texas 2 to nothing uh, as a sixth seed playing one. And I remember telling the guys on the bus, we were going to try to win this game because we had to win a game. In the NCAA, some, we had to win it today so that somebody could come back one day and compete for the regional championship. And we put our two best pitchers out. We started our third pitcher, let him go three innings, Buff Hockman, and took him out even though he was doing okay, and then put in Michael Ketterman, uh, because I didn't think Michael could go nine, but we had Michael Strong for six, the last six, and we rolled the dice. We went with our two best because we wanted to get a win. We beat them. Obviously, it was a great win for us. Uh, and then the guys were relaxed and we just kind of pieced it together from there. Beating Creighton in extra innings and then we beat Long Beach State. Both of them had been in the World Series the year before. Uh, so they were huge wins for the program. And then after turning around and, and uh, winning both of those games on a, on a Sunday, uh, we were on the field from 4 o'clock in the afternoon to 1 in the morning. Then had to play 12 o'clock, play Texas the next day. Came out, they scored two in the first. We hung in there. We scored four at the top of the ninth. The stretch by Kieschnick and the pitch. Line drive down the right field line. It's a fair ball and VCU will take the lead. Salve scores. Luenowitz scores. And moving into second base with a double is Mark Strickmatter. Unbelievable. It has happened here in the ninth inning. And I think something that uh, that uh, those kids obviously will never forget and something that VCU fans probably never thought was possible. The stretch for the 2-2 pitch to Abby. Hard hit ground ball to third baseman Fields. Steps on the bag and VCU will be in the game tonight with Texas at 7 o'clock as the game is over. And you really got to give credit to the Rams. They scratched back and scored four runs in the ninth to force the game tonight, Bill. I'll tell you, Bill, this is a ball club that you simply can't count out and they proved it. This great moment has been brought to you by the Virginia Lottery.